everyone welcome back to crack concepts so in today's video i will be discussing ranking functions like rank dense rank and row number so let's begin with that also do watch the video till the end as i have a small announcement in the end so watch the video till the end and let's begin with the video so i will be using this table let me show you the columns okay so this is my table employees which has employee id employee name address department id department name and the salary of each employee now let's do one thing okay let's add the rank function i will uh, write it and i'll explain you what it means okay just a second so i will write rank over okay partition by so let's partition it by department id okay and after that if you want to give it some order so i will say order by salary descending order okay okay let's run this okay let's give in okay just a second Oh, sorry this has to be over here hmm. so this is our output so let me explain you what this output means okay so uh, first we have written select star so all the columns will be selected then we have rank so these are all the columns and then we have this column so this whole uh, this, this whole expression will be renamed as rank so this is our rank and this is the output for this highlighted expression okay so let's understand this uh, this says rank over partition by department id order by salary descent so let's understand this first so first we are partitioning the table by department ids so we have three department ids in our table one two and three so we will partition it in three parts so this is the first department second department so all the departments will get together okay so all the i mean all the employees in one department will get in one partition so like this all the employees in department one are here then all the employees in department two are here and all the employees in department three are here okay so this is our first thing partition by department id which we have done we have done the partition after that inside the partition order by salary in descending order so inside these partition okay in this partition okay now we are only considering the first partition which is department id one so we will only consider this and we will not care about the rest of the uh, call uh, rows okay here and here we have these salaries and here the salaries will be sorted in descending order so as you can see this is the order so inside the partition we will order it uh, in the descending order okay uh, salary wise okay so this is what we did now here we have written rank rank over this is now over here we will uh, give it an uh, give it a rank okay one two three okay so this is how we have given the rank different partition will start with different rank now as you can see our partition number two that is department id two starts from here and here the rank will start from one so one and two then here again you can see it is one one three four now why is it so so we are using rank function over here here if okay if the values of the two rows are same so here we are uh, sorting it in in this order in descending order okay of salary so as you can see over here these two employees phoebe and ted they have the same salaries so if the values are same they will have the same rank and hence we uh, hence here they have the same rank one one but in rank what is different is here after that instead of using two we will use three so number two is skipped why is it skipped because we already have two rows over here so one one three four so the number two will be skipped so this is what rank function is dense rank function is also seems slightly different so let me show you all what it is just a minute okay so the exact same thing let's just copy 
okay and i will i i mean it will be the same thing and i will just write dense over here and now here i will give it okay now have a look over here look at it okay hmm. now if you can see okay select star means all the employees will be selected now in each department we uh, now it will be partition one 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 two two three two three and in rank we have one two three one two three dense rank is also same but there is just one difference here the number two will not be skipped here all the numbers will be used so one two three and if they have the same value they will have the same rank okay so in case of rank in case of rank function we were skipping numbers okay in case rank was being repeated we were skipping numbers but in dense rank we will not skip any number okay so th this is the, the only difference between dense rank and rank okay so it will first partition your columns sorry partition your rows uh, uh, according to the column that you have specified after that it will give an order to it and after that based on the function you have used rank or dense rank the ranks will be given okay in case of dense rank no number will be skipped but in case of rank the number will be skipped if multiple rows have the same rank and also remember that the same i mean the rows that have the same value will have the same rank okay now let's see the third um, third this thing um third ranking function which is row number okay let me write it over here okay here i will write row number okay okay and the same thing okay okay now in case of row number it doesn't care about the rank or it doesn't care what the value is no number is skipped and it will uh, i mean consecutive numbers will be used one two three one two three one two three four like this so as you can see over here even though these two were having the same salaries and they will uh, uh, i mean in uh, when we were using the ranking for rank and dense rank they were having the same rank but in case of row number row number doesn't care if the value is same or not it will be one two three four like i mean it, uh, it will just use consecutive numbers one two three four and if you see the second department over here see this is the second uh, sorry this is the second partition department id 2 1 2 this is the department id 1 here the row numbers are 1 2 3 1 2 3 1 2 1 2 3 4 so this is the only difference in case of rank in case of rank uh, and dense rank if the values have i mean if the rows have the similar value they will be given the same rank uh, and uh, and number will be skipped in case of rank function but in case of dense rank no number will be skipped although two rows can have the same dense rank okay that is possible but in case of row number no number is skipped and consecutive numbers are used so this is the difference between rank dense rank and row number and i hope this video uh, was clear to y'all and now it's time for the big news my sql ebook and notes is now available you can check out the link in my description box to grab a copy of yours this ebook consists of every possible concept that you need to know before your interviews i have shared literally everything in the ebook from the very basic to advanced I have also shared tips and tricks for interviews, so go grab a copy of yours. Do check out the link in the description box to understand and to see all the various topics that will be dis uh, that will be covered in the ebook. Do check out the link in the description box, and I will see you guys in my next video.